Thanks for joining us for our math lesson today. Everyone say hello. Hello. Great. Let's do our meditation to begin. Think about our heart center. That's right. Two fingers to find our heart center. Left hand. And our left. And close your eyes. Everybody close your eyes. Feel for boom, 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 boom in your heart center. Move your right hand into your lap. Keep your eyes closed. Keep thinking about your heart center. End our meditation with three breaths together. One, two, and our last one, three. Start to wiggle your toes. Slowly start to wiggle your fingers. Slowly open your eyes and let's begin our math lesson. In this math lesson, we're going to review our combined operations for addition and subtraction. So that means we're going to look at equations that have more than one step to do them. So maybe two pluses or two minuses or a minus and a plus in the same equation. So I think our friends are pretty familiar with these. We're gonna go through some pretty quick. We're gonna give our friends a chance to do some at the board just after a short review. Then we're gonna spend the rest of our class playing a tic-tac-toe game. So let's do a few together. Raise your hand when you know the answer to this. Keep it secret. Keep it secret. First thing we do, we always want to look in those parentheses. Good. If this is easy for you, that is wonderful. Try to think about it in your mind. One of our friends is thinking smart and counting on her ruler. Very nice. Okay, got it friends? One, two, three. Wonderful. We do our 12 minus six in our parentheses. 
8 doesn't change. 8 plus 6 equals 14. So our answer is 14. Very nice work. Let's try. We've got some bigger numbers here. We see some bigger numbers, but we're going to do the same thing. Always start in your parentheses. <laughs> Your parentheses. Always start in your parentheses. So you want to look at this part first. Think about what that is in that parentheses. <laughs> Do the parentheses first. Then our answer. Okay, raise your hand if you know just the answer for inside our parentheses. What's 23 minus 19? Four. Good, equals 4. So we put our 4, 7, and our minus doesn't change. So we have 7 minus 4. Raise your hand if you know what 7 minus 4 is. Easy. Easy, right? Yeah, what's 7 minus 4? Three. 3. You got it, friends. So even if it looks kind of weird at first, just do those parentheses to start and then it won't seem so bad at all. Okay? So we're gonna do a couple more together and then you're gonna get a chance to practice on your own. Okay? 43 plus 25 minus 12. We're gonna do 25 minus 12 first, that's right. That's right. Yep, that's what's in our parentheses. Raise your hand when you know what is inside of our parentheses here. One, two, three. Thirteen. Thirteen, good. So 25 minus 12 is 13. Did we change anything here? No. 43 plus 13. Raise your hand when you've got it. Raise your hand when you know what that answer could be. School, think about it, bud. Think about it. Got it? Yeah. Do your ones place and then your tens place. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Good job. Three plus three for our ones place is six. Four plus one for our tens place is five. That gives us 56. Very nice work. So this looks like a lot of big numbers, but you know what to do first. You know what to do first. You might have to do some borrowing. You can do it on scrap paper, yeah. You might have to do some borrowing. If you want to write it down on your scrap paper, you can do that. You can do that. 85 minus 50, 82 minus 55. You might have to do some borrowing because can we take five away from two? Hmm. We have two, can we take away five? 82, 55, but I'll go first. What is, which one's first? 82. There you go, yeah, 82 minus 55. So use your scratch paper. Great job, you're borrowing very nicely. Very nice work. Good job. Close. Close. Okay, can someone do our subtraction here? Okay, come on up. So we're going to do 82 minus 55 because we can't take away 5 from 2. We can't take away 5 if we only have 2. That's not going to work. But we can change our numbers. So we did some borrowing here. Now we have 12 minus 5. We can do that. 27. Okay. Very nice work, my friends. Thank you. Do we change anything with our 67? Yeah. No. So now we have 67 minus our 27. Raise your hand if you know what 67 minus 27 is. That should be an easy one. Should be an easy one. We're going to say it on three. We're going to say it on three. 
One, two, three. Forty. Good. Seven minus seven is zero. Six minus two is four. Okay, we're going to have some friends come up and show us how to do some of these problems. Okay, go to town, friends. A lot of these problems you're going to have to borrow. You can do it on your paper, too. Yeah. Oh, cool. Very nice, Sharon. So, Pong Pong can try it out as well. We'll get some more scratch paper. Start with your parentheses. Start with your parentheses. If you need some scratch paper, you can have some scratch paper. Let's see. 15. 15? For which one are you doing? No. No? 15. Okay. All right. So we had 65 minus 23? Equal 56. What's 65 minus 23? Just this part first. What's your answer? 42. 42, good. Oh. oh my gosh. Okay, just a sec. 42. Our 14 doesn't change. What's our total answer? 56. Great job, friends. Finished? Still working. Okay, you can erase. Okay, we had 26 plus 12. Which is what, answer, what number? 38, so that we change that. 75 minus 38 stays the same. What's 75 minus 38? What's your answer? You got it. 37, great job. Okay, friends, hold on. Chill, chill, chill. Okay, 45 plus 9, what's the answer? Fifty-four, and then we have 89. Minus 54 is what? 30. Very nice. Okay, you're good to erase. You can do it. Start in that parentheses first. Yep, you guys are going to go next. I don't have any more blue friends. You're going to have to get blue from someone else. You want purple? Okay. All right, great job, friends. Everybody's working on the parentheses first. Yep, 36 minus 4. It's 36 minus 4. 6 minus 4. I got it. You got it? Oh, flip those around. Because what's 25? What's 28 plus 15? Definite. What's 28 plus 15? 43? Good. So we're still going to think 75 minus 43. So we need to switch this around. Good. Okay, tell us what you did, buddy. Uh, 56 minus 24 equals 32. Good. 32 plus 43 equals 75. You got it, my friend. Great job. Great job. You can go erase. You can go erase. Okay, so we've got two. What about three minus zero? Three minus zero. Three minus zero? Three. Yep. Okay, here, take this one. Our blue is not working so good. Okay, tell us what you did. Tell us what you did. Very nice job. You're good to erase. You're good to erase. Okay, so we've got 32 there. Good. So now we have 25 plus 32. Go ahead and solve that for us. 25 plus 32. Close. Close. Change it up. 2 plus 5. 2 plus 5. Yeah, the black is hard. Just push hard, push hard. Plus. Plus, 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 plus. You guys are going to go next. You're going to go. Six. Okay, thank you. 
Seven. Seven, okay. Okay, what about your tens place? What, three plus two? Three plus two. Three plus two. Three plus two. Five. Good. Fifty-seven. Fifty-seven. Great job. You're good to erase. You're good to erase. You can erase. And our last three friends are going to come up. Okay. Pot, can you erase for us? Thank you. Can you erase? And two, come on up. Uh, you're on that side. Two, you're, you're in the middle. Yep, you're in the middle. Okay, you're over here, friends. You're over here. Yep, that one's you. <laughs> We're going to give you a new one. Don't you worry. Okay, start in the middle. Start right in the middle. Ten minus five. Okay. Okay, go. Yeah, all right, buddy, great job. So 10 minus 5 is 5. So we're going to think 17 minus 5. What's 17 minus 5? Okay. Okay. Can you take 8 away from 7? There we go. Great job. Very nice. 21. So is that your answer? Not yet. Not yet. 28 minus 21. 17 minus 5. Yeah, what's 17 minus 5, my friend? It will one. Not one. Mm. Five. Let's count together. If we have 17, we're going to take away 5. Okay? 10. 16. 15. 14. 13. 12. 12. 12. So our answer is 12. 12, like this. 1 and 2. 1 and 2. 1 and the 2. Very nice. Good job. So 10 minus 5 is 5. 17 minus 5 is 12. Good job, buddy. You can erase. So we're going to do some stretching. Okay. Put your arms in a T. Put your arms in a T. Fly like a bird. Fly like a bird. Good job. Jump like a bunny. Jump like a bunny. Swim like a fish. Swim like a fish. Like this. Like this. Okay. Run like a horse. Run like a horse. Stay at your desk, but run like a horse. Good job, friend. Pretend you're a deer. Pretend you're a deer. <laughs> All right, great job. You have 10 seconds to be a monkey. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. No more monkeys. No more monkeys. You're all back into students. You're all back into students. Let's try to balance. We're going to try to balance very quietly. Very quietly. Stand on one leg. You can put your other leg in front. You can put it behind. Or whatever you want to do, try to do it quietly. Put your arms out. You can balance. Good job. Okay, stand on your other leg. Change sides. Change sides. You can put your foot in front. You can put it behind. Try to balance. Try to balance. Good. <laughs> Good job. Very nice. Try to balance. Woo. Okay, good friends. Stand on two legs. Stand on two legs. Let's do three big claps. Take four big steps. 
Take a seat. We're going to play a math game with tic-tac-toe. So when we play tic-tac-toe, we have a board that looks like this. And we have X's and O's. And you want to get three in a row, right? So you can get three in a row like this. How, how else can you get three in a row? Is there another way you can win? Can you only win like this? Yeah. How, else, how else can you win? You can win across like this. Good. Like you. Like this. Or how else? Yes. Also on the diagonal. You could win on the diagonal like this. And like this. Okay? Good, friends. So we're going to play a math game. A little bit different. Kind of like bingo where we want them in a row. So we're going to have an X team and an O's team. And you're going to have to work together with your team to solve an equation. And if you get that equation right first, you get to put an X or an O on the board. OK, friends? So we're going to move our chairs a little bit, and then we'll show you how we play our game. X. 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 O. 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 X. O, O, X. Okay? Remember what you are? Remember what you are. Okay, friends. Everybody stand up. If you are an X, come on this side. If you're X's, come on this side. Okay, you're going to sit with your friends over here. X is over here. O's over here. If you're an O. If you're an O, come over here. Very nice. Very nice. You're going to work with your teams. You're going to try to solve the equation. Here's some scratch paper at your desk. Here's some scratch paper for your desk. You can put it here. You're going to get an equation on the board. If you solve it with your team first and correct, you get to put an X or an O on the board first, OK? Yeah. And after this, we're going to play with our chairs, too. OK? So here we go. Get ready. Are you X's or O's? O. Are you X's or O's? X. All right. We've got our O's and our X's. Here we go, friends. Get ready with your scratch paper. Get ready with your scratch paper. Let's see. Our first one. Plus 14 minus 7 in our parentheses. You might have to do some carrying or some borrowing. Yep, make a big X wherever you want. Okay, one X. Okay. Twenty-four minus fifteen plus three. Good job, friends. Think hard. Think hard. Got it quick. Show me. All right. All right. Okay. Our O's are fast. Okay. Good job, friends. Good job. Are you ready, friends? Okay. okay. Help your team, bud. <laughs> Work with your team. Help your team. Help your team. Help your team. 
Good job, friends. Very nice. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Here's some more paper if we need. Okay. The O's are getting close. O's are getting close. Get ready. Ready? Are we ready? Okay. Who's got it? Who's got it? Show me on your paper. Show me on your paper. Show me on your paper. Show me. Where's, it? Where's the papers, Miles? Good. Good job. Okay. Okay. All right. Good job, friends. Very nice. Okay. Now everybody, bring your chair to the front of the room. Bring your chair to the front of the room. So we're gonna play again. We've got our nine squares with our nine chairs. So every time you get an answer right, someone from your team is gonna come sit down in the chair, okay? So you guys are gonna be the O's or the X's, okay? And you can hold your hand so we know where you are. Mm -hmm. You can do O like this or like this or X or X, whatever you wanna do, okay? So if you win, you get to put a person from your group down on your board, okay? Ready? Ready. Got your scratch paper ready? Got it ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Okay, 53 plus 24 minus 8. 24 minus 8. Solve it on your paper. Come show me that paper. Our friends are using their ruler as a number line. That is a great idea. Keep going. <laughs> okay, you got it on your paper? Yeah. Come show me. Come show me. Let me see. What's your answer? Okay, good. Oh, you are so close, my friends. 69, okay. Okay. Bang Pan, are you an X or an O? Are you guys X's or O's? O's, okay. We've got our O in the middle. We've got an O in the middle. Okay, friends, get ready. Get ready. Get it on your paper. Tell me when you're finished. <laughs> yeah. Let me see. Good job. Okay. Because look, friends, look, we have 17 plus 3. Everybody take a look up here. Everybody take a look up here. 17 plus 3 is 20. We have 47 minus 20 is 27. Okay. Here's our next one. Here's our next one. Twenty-five minus sixteen plus nine. <laughs> yeah, we can give the winner a sticker. Twenty-five minus sixteen plus nine. Come show me. Yep. Good job, friends. Very nice. Sixteen plus nine is twenty-five. 
25 minus 25 is zero. Okay, friends, good job. Thanks for joining us for our math lesson today. Everyone say goodbye. Goodbye. Okay.